And now in business, it is imperative for Nigeria to focus on sectors with great potential for inclusive development when prioritizing growth drivers. These were the words of foremost industrialist Aliko Dangote at the second Adeola Odutola lecture organized by the Manufacturers Association of Nigeria. Justin Akadoye tells us more. Nigeria has experienced fluctuations in manufacturing output growth over the years as a result of overdependence on crude oil revenues. Captains of industry, including the organized private sector, have converged on this hall to dialogue on changing the narrative. Thank you. Kindly have your seat. The United Nations says Nigeria has remained in the developing nation cadre as total exports account for 16% of GDP in 2021 and unemployment at 22.56%. Foremost industrialist Aliko Dangote emphasizes that no nation has ever attained developed nation status without having a thriving manufacturing sector. The experience in various parts of the world has shown that industrialization drives economic growth and development, which improves living standards as evident by the high output and per capita income in industrialized countries. Countries smaller than Nigeria, such as Singapore and South Korea, have an average per capita GDP of about 65,000 and 31,000 respectively due to the level of industrialization which they have achieved. To drive manufacturing growth in Nigeria, Dangote points the country in the direction of industry-oriented policy, adequate infrastructure and a well-developed SME sector. The country's dwindling industrial performance has significantly has significant Social economic implications as poverty and unemployment continues to rise. While there is a pressing need to create more jobs, the high cost of doing business in the face of declining consumer purchasing power puts enormous strain on manufacturers, with many scaling down production and some of them shutting down completely. The onset of forex crisis in 2015 and the global pandemic in 2020 presented manufacturers with a difficult set of circumstances. The situation has recently been compounded by skyrocketing inflation. Inflation had always had to deal with the various challenges uh, in an economy that over the years has seen many challenges, many uh, ups and downs. Today, the situation has improved significantly. I believe that the economy, although it is still uh, facing low growth situations, uh, but at least it has remained uh, operational and has uh, been able to weather most of the tide. In today's world, there is no doubt that the level of industrialization is one of the basis for determining economic development. The manufacturing sector, therefore, acts as a catalyst that accelerates the pace of transformation and diversification of the economy, enables the country to fully utilize the endowment and to depend less on foreign supply of finished goods or raw material for its economic growth, development and sustainability. Dangote advises the government to ensure it consults widely with stakeholders when taking far-reaching decisions address the speed of insecurity and invest in infrastructure among others. Justin Akadonye, Plus TV News, Lagos.